All right. <clears throat> Good evening and welcome to Heart Soul Yoga with Sharon. I am Sharon and welcome to our restorative practice this evening. So for practice tonight, you'll need a blanket, <laughs> blanket, <laughs> um, a bolster and a block. And then if you'd like an eye pillow for Shavasana at the end to have that handy as well. So we're going to begin on our backs. So if you'd like to make your way down, but before you go down, I want you to make sure that you have your block close by. And I want you to take your blanket and we're going to roll it up like a sausage. We'll take it whatever way. So it's long enough, nice and long. So just kind of roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to bring the feet to supine butterfly position. And then we're going to take this blanket and we're going to place it right on top of the arches of the feet and then we're going to wrap it around so that when the knees rest out, they can relax on that blanket. Okay. So we're going to slowly get that set up and then we're going to make our way down to our back in supine butterfly with the blanket as a support. So let's make our way down. Ah, beautiful. You can adjust a blanket to whatever feels good for your knees or your thighs or your legs. So as you're starting to settle in, try to relax the arch of your back here. Tuck your chin in towards your chest. Let the arms relax out, palms to the ceiling. And we're just gonna pause here, breathing. Checking in. And hopefully this practice tonight will allow you to let go open your heart and find a little peace within. So just pause here. We'll be here for several minutes. So get nice and comfy. Bringing those eyes closed. Letting your breath help to relax you. Letting your breath allow you to let go a little bit at a time with each exhale. Maybe you start to deepen your breath a little bit here. Just use your breath. Let your breath take you where you need to go.
Breathing, letting go, finding peace. Let this practice lead you to that peace within you by allowing you to let go through your breath. Maybe you place the hands on the belly, feeling the movement of the breath. We'll pause here for just a couple more breaths. If the hands are on the belly, slowly release them down. And we're gonna slowly let the feet come up to the mat. And we're gonna take this blanket and just kind of snake it out from around your feet. Just let it go off to the side here for a little bit. We're gonna walk the feet out to the edge of the mat, just slightly wider than the hips here. Let the knees and the thighs relax in towards each other. Constructive rest. Just pause here for a breath. Now we're gonna take this blanket that's in this sausage roll and we're just gonna lay it right underneath our chest. And we're gonna let the hands just rest right there for right now, right on the blanket. Release the arms out to the sides. And with your next exhale, we're gonna reach the arms up overhead. And then gently wrap your arms around yourself. Just take it as far as feels good. So if you need a little support for the arms, you can use that blanket to support the arms as you give yourself a gentle hug here with the legs resting in constructive rest. And we'll be here for several minutes, so just allow the body to settle into the pose. Allow the breath to find its way wherever it needs to go. Continue to breathe. Continue to let go. Continue to look for that peace within. Maybe ask yourself, what does that peace feel like? 
What does it look like? If you'd like to switch your arms the opposite way, feel free. If you're happy where you are, stay right there. Beautiful breath. Just allow that breath to take you wherever you need to go here. Let's pause here for just a couple more breaths. Let's release the hands to the blanket as you slide it down towards the middle of the body. Walk the feet back to sit bones position, sending the knees up to the ceiling. And we'll just pause here. Two more breaths here. We're going to gently slide the blanket off to the side once again. And slowly, mindfully roll to one side. And just pause here for a breath or two. Use her arms and her hands. Slowly press the body upright. Mm. Pause once you're upright here. Before we go into our next pose, we're going to unroll the blanket. Mm. And we'll fold it back up. And we'll just set it off to the side as we'll need it in a little bit. Let's make our way to tabletop. Have your block near the top of your mat and the blanket off to your right side. Finding your tabletop. <sighs> Let's begin with some cat cow here. Inhale as you lift out, belly drops towards the floor. Exhale, bring the chin towards the chest, arch the back. Inhale, lifting out. Nice and slow, gentle movements with your breath. Exhale, bring it to cat pose. 
And we'll just continue with this nice, flowing, gentle cat cow. Feel free to pause at one of the two for an extra breath if that feels good. Just listen to your body, whatever it needs. We'll take a couple more breaths, a couple more movements here in your cat and cow. And we'll make our way to tabletop here. Nice gentle gaze down towards the mat. Just pause here, maybe sway the hips if that feels good. And we're going to find our block and we're going to bring it in. And we'll probably have to adjust it in a little bit here. We're going to come into puppy pose. So we're going to let the head, forehead, rest on the block. So we're going to walk the hands out as you slowly let the heart center melt down. Let the forehead rest on the block. And pause here for several breaths. I forgot to tell you, sometimes it's nice to have the eye pillow on the block to rest the forehead. Continue with your breath. Continue to feel your body, your mind letting go. Continuing to find that peace within. Let's take a couple more breaths here. Very slowly, very mindfully, walk your body back up to the tabletop. And we'll slide the block off to the side. Making sure your blanket is on your right side of the mat. We're gonna slowly lower the body down to the belly. Hmm. Pause with the hands, allowing the forehead to rest on the hands. Pause here.
And we'll take a couple more breaths here. And we'll slowly lift up. And we'll let the arms, forearms release down to the mat. So have the elbows almost in line with your chest. Spread the fingers nice and wide. And let the hips release down. The feet can be as far as part as feels good here. For now, we're just gonna keep our gaze gently at the mat here in our Sphinx pose. We're gonna to begin to slowly lift the head looking forward to take it a little bit of a back bend, just a teeny tiny bit. Pause here. Let those hips relax into the earth. Take two more breaths here. And we're going to slowly let the right knee bend up, rest it on that blanket, and come back to your Sphinx pose here. If you'd like to take this into a shoulder stretch, come into a thread the needle, bring the right arm forward, and let the left arm release in to a thread the needle. You can also use the block to let the head rest on the block. And we'll pause here for several minutes. If at any time the threading of the shoulder becomes uncomfortable, just make your way back to Sphinx pose, or you can also lower the forehead down to stack hands into fallen tree. Breathing, letting go, finding peace. Take a couple more rounds of breath here. And 
I'll slowly unthread. And just very slowly, very mindfully, release the right leg back down. And then we'll carefully take the blanket and slide it over to the opposite side. And then we'll get ready to do that same pose of sequence of poses on the opposite side. So we'll start in Sphinx, just gently gazing down at the mat. Slowly lift your gaze up to look straight forward, taking your body to a slight little back bend here. And those feet can be as far apart as feels comfortable, letting the hips relax into the earth. Breathing nice and deep. Keep your breath flowing here. All right, we're gonna slowly let the left knee bend and bring it up toward the blanket, coming into fallen tree position with the legs. Pause here in your Sphinx pose for a couple more breaths. And then if you like to take that shoulder stretch on the opposite side, just bring the right arm, right left arm forward a little bit. Let the right arm slide through. And again, you can rest your head on the block if that feels good. Or you can let it go all the way down to the floor whatever feels best to you. And we'll pause here for several minutes. So find your settled pose and then make your way back to your breath. Using that breath to let go. Keep using that breath to find peace within. We'll take two more nice deep breaths here.
And then we're going to slowly, mindfully begin to first unthread. And slide the blank off to the side. Make your way back to Sphinx Pose. Pause here. Looking forward. Two breaths here. Slowly let that left leg float back. Full Sphinx. We're going to gently, mindfully, slowly press the body up. Find tabletop. And we're going to use our blanket once again to get wide across the mat. And that's going to help cushion our knees. And we're going to find our bolster and we're going to place it long ways on the mat. If you'd like to take this to an incline, just slide the block underneath it. I'm going to do that with mine. Just a very slight incline here. So have the blanket right at the edge of the bolster. Then we're going to take our knees nice and wide. Take them as wide as feels good here. Kiss those toes in the back and let the hips relax back towards the toes. And we're going to slowly lower the body onto the bolster, turning to one side or the other. Let the hands release off to the sides here. Incline child's pose. Find your breath. Have you been able to let go? Have you found a little bit of peace within you? Okay, any point you like to turn your head so it's facing in the other direction, feel free. Keep breathing air. Keep allowing your breath to bring you to where you can let go of anything that you need to. Keep allowing your breath to guide you, lead you, help you to find peace within. We'll pause here for just a couple more breaths.
slowly, mindfully. Press the body up away from the bolster. Walk the knees in, finding a tabletop position over the bolster. And then slowly, we're gonna shift to where our back is up against the bolster. So just take your time very gently. And we're gonna recline back on the bolster for a heart opener. The feet can be in butterfly as we were in the beginning of the practice, or they can extend all the way out in long length of the mat, whatever feels best to you. And you might change in between. So slowly let the body release back. Release the arms out to the sides, palms facing the ceiling. Let the legs go where they need to go here. And we're just gonna pause here for several minutes. Just breathing, feeling our heart open, feeling ourselves, allowing us to let go. Finding peace within so that we can share that out through our heart to others. Pause, breathe. Let's take about three more nice deep breaths here. Slowly let the feet come to the mat, knees pointed to the ceiling. And the best way to come out of this is to slowly roll to one side. Let one arm guide you in the roll. The other arm supports you in the roll. Bring the body upright very carefully, very mindfully. And then we're gonna make our way down to our backs. But I want you to have the bolster close down by your legs so you can have that for Shavasana should you need that. And have the blanket and the block off to your side as well. Slowly make your way down to your back.
Keep the knees pointed up to the ceiling, feet to the floor. While we're paused here, find your block. You can choose to, I'm sorry. You can choose to pad the block with the bowl, with the blanket, if that feels good to you. We're gonna come in to supported bridge here. So sometimes I like to pad my block with my blanket here. So we're gonna take a nice deep inhale. And as we exhale, we're gonna slide the hips up just enough to where we can find our block and our blanket. Slide it underneath. Make sure that block is right underneath those hips, not the low back. And we're just gonna pause here. Let the arms release out to the sides. Just enjoy your breath here. Enjoy the peace you are building within you. Enjoy the quietude. Enjoy the relaxation. Enjoy being with yourself. If you're happy here in supported bridge, stay right here. If you'd like to extend the legs up towards the ceiling, coming up to legs up with the hips rested on the block. And we'll pause here for a few more breaths in whichever position feels best to you whether it's staying at supported bridge or releasing the legs up. Using that exhale to take care of anything that you need from within. If your legs are up, we're going to begin to slowly. One leg at a time, lower it back down, finding supported bridge once again. Nice and slow. Once you're in supported bridge, we'll pause here for just two more breaths. On the next inhale, lift the hips just high enough where you can slide the blanket off to one side and the block as well. You won't need the block anymore, so you can set it up away. Slowly lower down. Mm. Find your bolster. We're going to let it come underneath our knees here. Let the knees drape over the bolster, calves drape over the bolster. 
Here's that blanket to cover up, to get nice and comfy. And find your eye pillow, whatever you're using for the eyes, if you have something. And we're gonna place that eye pillow on the eyes. Slowly release the arms out to the sides. You have made your way to Shavasana. So we're gonna let everything become very still, very heavy, releasing into the mat, holster, floor. Breath slowing down. Heart rate is slowing down even more. We'll be here for several minutes. So enjoy the peace that you have built through your practice tonight as you rest. And I'll bring you back together at the end.
very slowly, very mindfully, just bring your breath back into your awareness. Try to remain as still as you can. Just feel your breath. Slowly add some small bodily movements. Be very careful with yourself here. And when you feel ready, slowly roll to one side. Pause on that side for a breath or two. And then use your arms and your hands. Slowly bringing the body upright. Making your way up to a comfortable seat. Ah, peace. May we all have it. May we all find it. Let's take one more breath together. Inhale, take the arms up overhead, bringing the palms together. Exhale, find your heart center, find your peace. Bow so slightly to yourself and thank yourself for allowing your body to breathe, for allowing your body to let go, and for allowing your body to find peace. And I thank you so much for joining me. The light in me sees and honors the light in you. Namaste. Thank you all very much. Hang on to that piece that you've just built and come back to it anytime you need it. And as always, be well.